This is one of the uh, access panels. So to get into the yeah, this nuts is to it. put the wingtip on. So they're all the skins that we've got to remade. All them. And then, uh, so this is the one I'm doing at the minute, is this access panel with like three, should be three slots on the drawing there, but they're not yeah. on it. But yeah, along the base there, they're the access at the top as well. So. so what do you do then? Just drill holes on, are they rivet holes then? And that is the line you're following, the yeah, yeah, scribed these are, ones? Yeah, the, the scribed ones are the, they're the, uh, that's the actual gap that'll be in the aircraft. Yeah. yeah. So and these will be riveted. I don't know if there's dub these sort of doublers go around these, you know, strengthening. Yeah. And then they'll have a plate attached to them, you know, like yeah. a door, so yeah. an access door. Mm. Yeah. But so these are all drilled off the old ones. So yeah. they're, uh, you know, one of those for making the lightning holes, you know, the yeah. flan them flanges. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, we, we've, got, we've ordered a tool for that now. Yeah. So it just means you... there's not so many bits have to go away then. Yeah. And with that lightning, do you, do you use the same, put soap around it and warm it up yeah, and then yeah. press it out? Yeah, because as I said, Jack was doing something the week and they kept cracking, didn't they? So yeah, like, yeah. He, uh, yeah, he sort of like annealed it, didn't he? And yeah. Up, yeah, yeah. Are these okay? You've got to make new ones. Or haven't they been yeah, the decision made? I think they're all okay, yeah. yeah. They'll go underneath, around these. Yeah. That's, that's your door, you know, you, you put a door on there and that's your access. Yeah. Oh, cool. Being perfect. No. So you most of put a cut in here and... It's only good for a pattern to a point. Yeah, yeah. Gets you the shape and then you... Then you check the whole measurement from whatever ribs or wherever the fit yeah, is from. Yeah, because again, if it's new ribs, you might do a better hole pattern in it anyways. Yeah. So you may not even use the existing hole patterns at all. No. Depending I, what the... I noticed one or two of them weren't in line. They wandered off on the old one. Yeah. And what came off. Not uncommon. I suppose the material must stretch and flex over the years. Well, yeah. I, I think most of the damage occurs either when you install it or remove it, to be honest. Yeah. I don't think it happens during service unless it actually has an impact. Yeah. I but see. if it... Uh, if so it this distortion would be from when you removed the yeah. yeah quite often just from from removing yeah. the fasteners yeah because you have to hit them hard enough to get them out and there's sorts of metal so yeah. there's nothing much you can do about it no, sometimes once you've stretched it that's it isn't yeah. it jack's working on the bulkhead so this is the mod you put in to know where it's going to go and yeah I just put it back in to remind me what it goes with. this is part of the mod that we believe that they put in for the heavier gun yeah because the way they, they, they it was tin snipped out and then this was oh that's in. right yeah, yeah the other rough yeah because they didn't take the whole frame out they just tin snipped off what they didn't want and whack this under it mm. so um, anodized what, see, no. yeah. and what you're doing on here now the bulkhead the bottom of the bulkhead yeah, goes across here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Using the old one as a template. It's all yeah. yeah. And that's the heavy gauge you've been waiting for. Yeah, then. It's fifty thou. It's two thou thicker than that. Is that two thou of an inch? Yeah. Uh, fifty thou. Yeah. Fifty thou an inch. Yeah. yeah. Not of a. No. Not metric. You can't quite get the right the right one now. So go up to thou and it, it's okay you know yeah it's the nearest we can get to it yeah. it's the right spec it's just not the right thing it's just a yeah. touch thicker yeah. so better up than down yeah so will you be able to drill um these holes through as will they be in the correct place well it's a bit of both because this is a new one you see there's a new one to go there that new one goes there so yeah as I'm using, I'm making a new plate as well, I'd rather position it correctly and drill new holes. Yeah, then um, use the old. Yeah, then use, then you, once you start drilling through and then make it match, you know, yeah. your unevenness gets passed along and things like that. Yeah, because I notice on a lot of, uh, when they take them off down there on the fins, that holes are not in a straight line, no, they not. wander off. Yeah, that's right. We're trying, we're trying to do it to a better standard. Yeah. I mean, this one you can see here, 
this this shape was for the old browning from ammunition feed and then they put the martin on well that's slightly different so they've put that on there because it's just it's not not the same shape yeah I mean, is that where the two actual slide the two comes through yeah. where the ammunition yeah. slide on but um i said to bob i could have made that the new one without that cut out but he said no try and make it to the original so got to do that but when that was fitted there was another hole there you see because that corner was cut off to allow this one to go on so there's a little hole there that's not needed i won't be making that again you won't put that in no right? see no so things do and look at the the unevenness of the holes which is not pretty so it will be done to a proper spec but you'll just make sure it yeah it looks okay, it looks well, it, it looks it like an engineering job and yeah. not a bodge job. Yeah. Well, it's different mods, mods on top of mods and, it, and you can see they chopped the end off there and then that hole then was redundant Yeah. and then that plate went over the top. So there's no need to put that hole back into the, no. new, to the new one. Did. Yeah. There's no point in trying to, if you rub that off it becomes weaker. Yeah. So I might as well put a new one on. Yeah. And that was going to do when it's painted that'll be riveted on there yeah and this this is the original one that one's okay that's going to go down the middle down the middle there and that way and that one's okay yeah it just needs a little bit more cleaning up there's nothing wrong with that no corrosion at all yeah. so that'll be put back in the right place there and then there's a, a few little ones to go on the end yeah Oh, it's coming on. Yeah, yeah, slowly but surely. All three holes finished. Return after servicing. Seeing the rivet letter I got to put in the new air where they went on. Yeah. We're going to overhaul number four. Yeah. 